VoiceOver Dooley is back in action. You dig? Oh, I cannot believe it. I cannot believe that your girlfriend break up with you. Oh my god, I feel so sad for you. Well, all I can say is that since you're single, you better not take my girl. Because we're gonna have some major consequences. You understand? Well, hello there. My name is Dooley Fruity Star. And I'm gonna be your teacher for today. Well, since we're gonna get back to math, I'm gonna call out your names. Okay, Tommy. Oh, Tommy. Is there a Tommy in the classroom? Tommy. Tommy, why don't you get your ass up? No one asked you to play Fortnite last night. Oh, you sleeping again? Well, hello there. My name is Dooley R. Bingora, and I am the President of the United States. Now, we have some serious job to do, so nobody is going to go to the bathroom. You can shit in your pants, whatever you can, or you can piss, and I'm going to be smelling the urine. Not that it's a good thing to smell, or your shit. And that means you, Mr. Alfredo. No baño comprende. Um, one time... I had this vegetarian pizza because I was vegetarian all. Like, I can't eat meat or chicken and stuff like that. So I had the vegetarian pizza because I'm like a vegetarian. And it was so good for a vegetarian. And I'm going to order that pizza again as a vegetarian because I don't like meat and all. Because it's like wrong in my system. So I had another vegetarian pizza, cause I'm like, a vegetarian. Totally, yeah. Oh my god, that is one cool experiment. I love you, Bill Nye. Well, hey daddy. No, I'm not in school, school's over. Well, I don't want to play soccer. I'm watching Bill Nye the Science Guy. He's doing some cool experiment. Okay, well, love you daddy, bye. I said I love you, Daddy, please! Let me watch Bill Nye the Science Guy! He's so cool! Yeah! Okay, bye! How in the blue fuck he does that? That's like cool! Wow, totally! Hey, everybody! Let's draw penis at him to see how he likes it! I said, let's draw penis at him to see how he likes it! Okay, like, dude, let's draw penis at him to see how he likes it! I already changed my accent, you fuckers! Well, hello, mother. Yes, I got my tuxedo, and it looks good on me, because... I'm sexy, and I know it! Well, I can't wait to go to my prom. My date's gonna be like... I'm sexy, and I know it! Of course, mother. I go to the gym, because... I'm sexy, and I know it! Totally! Oh, what really amazed me is that I love Dragon Ball Z! I love Goku, but I really like Vegeta more! And if I was Vegeta, I would be saying like... Hey, Kakarot! I will always be better than you! Let me go find Bobbity so I can become Monty Vegeta! So I can destroy the whole planet, Kakarot! And I'll be better than you! Well, hey there, Xemnas! And thank you for this interview! I just want to ask you a question! Why, oh why, do you want Kingdom Hearts? The only reason that I want Kingdom Hearts is that I want to control the darkness. You see, me and nobody having a heart can change everything. Once I find Sora, I will get his Keyblade and I will rule Kingdom Hearts. Does that really answer your question, oh foolish one? It sure did! But all I can say is that I love Sora and he's gonna whip your motherfucking ass so you have no chance because you don't have no heart. Well, happy birthday to my best friend in the whole wide world. I wanted to give you this. It's this ultra super baby powder. Great. I hope you take good care of it and don't sniff too hard if he knows what I mean. <laughs> well, hello there. My name is Jong Hello Cho. That's right. My name is Jong Hello Cho. And my girlfriend break up with me. Me living in the United States of America. Illegally. But I want to sing a song so she can be back with me. All right, here goes. Baby, come back. You can build it on, on me. Baby, come back. I'm laying alone in bed with no drawers, no boxers, no tiny waddies, no brief. Of course, I wear briefs. But I hope she gets a picture. Because I really want you back as a boyfriend. 
live in this world, in the United States, illegally. Well, hello, daddy. I just want to tell you that I'm in trouble again in school. Where were you in trouble for? Son, when I went to school, this black guy was bothering me. So I called my nigger. What do you mean you call my nigger? <gasps> you got me saying it too. <laughs> I can't believe I said the word nigger. I'm saying it again.